Texas, Texas Tech. Oh, the man defense by the Longhorns frustrated Texas Tech early. They got a few of those push-off calls right there. Got Rese Caldwell in trouble. The defense really generating offense for Texas tonight. Rese Caldwell finished with 24 points. She can just flat out shoot the basketball. Well, she can. You can't give her much daylight, that's for sure. She's got the quick release, and she had some nice ones tonight for Texas Tech. But Joyner Holmes, the freshman from Cedar Hill, showing why she will ultimately be an All-American at Texas. So versatile, so strong in the paint. She had a double-double, 10 and 10, but she was so phenomenal in transition. Rebound, let me get the ball down the floor, finish the layup or the pull-up jumper. To the second half we go. It was more Texas, balance scoring, high low to Kelsey Lane from Holmes. Yeah, right out of the halftime, Texas going inside to their post players, trying to establish that game. And then Brooke McCarty nails a three. Brooke McCarty was silent in the first half, but the Texas Tech, Tech kept coming in transition. You know, they never stop. They never stop playing. When you got three point shooters like Texas Tech, you're not ever out of a game. And they made a good run at it in the fourth quarter. The defense kept coming for Texas. McCarty broke away with this one. Some great defense from LaShawn Higgs to get that going in the upcoming schedule for Texas. They will travel to Iowa State to play in Ames, Iowa. That will be tough. No question about it. They better bring their coats because I'm sure it's cold <laughs> up there. All right, they also play at Kansas and then TCU and Oklahoma State. So our final score is 67-47 here at the Irwin Center. Join us for more live college basketball January 4th, men's basketball, Oklahoma State versus Texas. Coverage starts at 6.30 p.m. Central. Coming up next, Longhorn Extra this week. For Hell Fortner, Tyler Denning, and our entire Longhorn Network college basketball crew, I'm Fran Harris saying so long and Happy New Year, everybody.